Hey there guys, it's JT here. So good morning. Um, I just woke up. It's um, 7 a.m. here in the Philippines. And the first thing I always do in the morning is get my phone and go to Facebook. And the first post that I saw there is this page that I like that's saying there's already a 6.87 gameplay update. So that gave me more spirit to get off bed and check it out. And I decided to share it with you guys check it out with you guys so that is what we are going to do today check it out so yeah let's do this i have already loaded up so here we go new gameplay update so the esm vanilla has already is already done it's over wings won it congratulations and there's a rumor that the 6.87 will be released and that's it really happened so here we go after an eventful and competitive wintertide season, Dota 2 welcomes the advance of Spring's renewal at this week's patch brings the release of the 6.87 gameplay update. With changes to ranked all pick, the addition of the minimap scan ability, new items, and a host of other balance adjustments, there's a lot to explore in the 6.87 change log. So that is where we are going. So Rubik and Batriders in the picture, meaning there has been changes to them. There you go. 6.87 gameplay update, 6.87. So, general reworked ranked all pick. Before picking phase begins, there is a 15 second voting phase to ban heroes. Each player votes for a different hero. Afterwards, half the heroes that were voted on will be randomly selected and banned. So, it's an all pick with banning. Okay. I don't even get it. <laughs> Moving on! Okay, this one is interesting. A scan ability. Scans target 900 AoE for 8 seconds. Indicates whether there are many heroes in the area during the 8 seconds. What is this? Starcraft? Do you guys... Do, if you guys have played Starcraft, there's like a scan ability there. The command center, it has a skill there that when you put it on the map, it will show, the, it will show where the enemy is. Or it will show something in the map. But that's because there's smoke in it. Oh, okay, so it's, it is an anti-smoke. What the hell does not show how many heroes there are, just if there are any enemies? What? Heroes are enemies, right? Okay, but this is kind of good, scan ability. Hmm, I wonder how and when will you use it? When is it crucial to use it? That's a good one. That's a good one. Good, good, good. Lane creep health upgrade, nah. Nah, blah blah. Tower true sight. Oh. Oh, yeah, they decreased the true sight of the tower. Okay. But the range is still the same, okay. Okay, this is good. This is a good. This is good balancing. Initial bounty rule no longer gives experience, only gold now. So no one will be out experienced. Sorry for bad English. Melee hero attack range increased from one. <laughs> it's a melee hero. Why increase it? What? Mm, yeah, blah, blah, blah. I'm just gonna get the important ones, the interesting ones, and the funny ones. Victor is now calculated on impact other than. Oh, okay. So it's no longer miss, miss, miss. It's now miss. Miss. Okay. Don't don't mind don't mind the the interpretation. Rogen Rogen <laughs> Rogen Roshan magic resistance reduced by seventy five to fifty. Wow, that's a big down. Oh nice. Oh thank you. Illusions now benefit from damage black. Block black block 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 block. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. Okay. Okay. Let's go to terrain. I don't give a damn about terrains. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. There's new items. Okay. Just wait. Someone just chatted me. Okay. My brother told me to update the computer upstairs. So when he gets home, it's already updated. And I'm not going to do that because I don't want to. It's blood torn. New item from Orchid. Oh, crystallized in a recipe. 
Oh, this is interesting. But all attacks on the silent target, including from the allies, gain true strike and a 1.35 times critical hit. Are you freaking kidding me? Wow! This is a pure anti phantom assassin. Imagine Invoker getting this item. Oh my gosh, that is a very sure kill. And Slark? I, it's okay for me, the 1.35 times critical hit, but the true strike? You won't miss. That's, that's freaking insane. That's, that's unbalanced. What the hell? Come on. That is so unbalanced. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on before I rage quit. Echo Saber, new item formed into obli from a Oblivion Staff and Ogre Club. Okay. Causes meal attack to attack twice in a quick suck. <laughs> what? An item like a blink strike of Phantom Assassin. Your double attack applies a 0 0.6 second 100% movement speed attack speed slow. Has a 5 second cooldown. Wow. A blink a Phantom Assassin blink strike plus Cardell's headshot. It's for melee heroes. Oh my goodness, does this work with Phantom Assassin? He ha she has a stifling dagger and a hundred percent moving speed attack speed slow if he has this item. Move on. Lightstone. New item. Release armor by two on attack. And it costs 300 gold. Side shop. Oh, used on Desolator. Oh, so this is a new item to create a Deso and a Medallion of Courage. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. So Courage has now reduced armor when you attack. And then when you put it, it, it adds another reduced armor. We'll see. We'll see. Infuse Raindrops. New consumable... Incontrolable... New consu consumable item. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, my, am I... My, what do you call that? My pronunciation, my pronunciation is bad. So, new item, wind lace. Uh, plus 20 movement speed. Drums and yules. Wow, come on. Yules already adds movement speed. And now you're going to be adding. Oh, no, it makes, oh, yeah, it, yeah. Same as Deso's Blightstone. It makes sense. Because yules. Without any movement speed item, it adds movement speed. So, yeah, adding this one makes sense with it. And drums too. Yeah, okay, yeah, you talk. Okay, now you're talking, Dota. Nah, logic, logic. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> what is this, Bleach versus One Piece? What is this, a custom game? It gives you 425 experience. First one is available at the 10 minute mark. Okay, I thought I thought you can just buy this one and go to level 1 immediately. <laughs> I level 2 immediately. I'm sorry for that. Okay, Tome of Knowledge and it does really name the same as in the black in the black versus one piece. No, Bleach versus one piece. What? Okay, so last one before we go to item changes, Hurricane Pike. New item formed from four staff with Dragonlance in the recipe. Mhm. Mm uh, you can pike uh, active let's go for the active one when using an enemy it pushes you both away from each other oh 45 meters each and allows you to attack the target without range restrictions for at four attacks for a maximum of five seconds oh wow so it's like that does not give vision over the enemy uh oh okay Okay, that's bad. Works normally like four step when used on self or allies. Oh, <laughs> it's anti melee heroes. Yeah. Okay, let's go for adding changes. It's no longer sacred relic, and it and it has a recipe. Oh, okay. Okay, so it makes you strong and tough. Because of the vanguard. Ooh, cool. Adds five armor. 
and it disincreased to 10 while active. Whoa, that's nice. Now returns damage before any kind of reduction and returns it in the same type as it, it was received. Ooh, so pure to pure. You pure me, I pure you. I pure you, you pure me. Alright. No longer ignore spell immune enemies. Oh my goodness! It goes through BKB? It still cannot hurt spell immune targets if the original damage type cannot, like magic. Yeah, of course. If it's magic, it does not return because you're on BKB. But on physical, it goes? Oh, I <laughs> BKB is anti-blade mail. I mean, yes, it's anti-blade mail. It's what the hell, Doto? Come on. Come on. Dragonlance now requires Ogre Club and two times Band of Helvenskin. Oh, instead of Ogre... Oh, it doesn't... Oh, no more attack speed? Ah, unfortunately. I... Cardell, he needs that because I always build face boots on him. Ah, they decrease the minutes of 60 seconds. No longer provides HP regen. Oh, come on! And reduce the mana? Why? Is it in balance? Is it Imba? Whoa, what is this? Remove chance to true strike on the target. So there's a true strike on Rod of Arrows? Really? Seriously? I'm gonna check that out. There's a true strike? Remove chance, or this is a bug that they that they removed. Oh, it gives accuracy, and how? Why? Why? It's staff of wizardry and vitality booster. Why would you give true strike to it? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Why? Alright, let's go to heroes. Once again, I'm gonna just gonna review what's interesting, what's funny, and what is balance and imbalance. Mm, nah, I'm not really interested. Uh, okay, Arc Warden. Okay, this is a long one. Flux no longer slows magic immune units. Okay, it's now purgeable. Oh, okay! Per Wait, what, what is Flux? I don't really use Arc Warden. Is that an SS? Flux, Arc Warden. I'm sorry, I, I'm not really uh, familiar with this hero. I don't really use it. Oh, what is this? Oh, so this is the slow one. Okay, okay. It's not purgeable. Okay, you can now remove it. Uh, magnetic field. This is the one that makes you miss 100%. That's bull crap. That is so unfair. Magnetic field now only evades attacks done from outside of the field. Yes! Thank you! Thank you so much! If you're the attacker, just go inside the field and it doesn't evade. Thank you! That's okay! Thank you for nerfing that! Oh, I don't care about the others. Whoa, no, no, no. Divine! Divine is no... It's no longer... Yes! Oh! Yes! Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> okay, someone just chatted me again. No longer Divine! No longer Imba! Rat Dodo! Thank you so much! <laughs> Why is Arc Warden not in the picture? He should be in the picture. <laughs> Goodbye, Arc Warden rats. Goodbye. No longer Divine. No longer Imba. Rat Dodo. Thank you so much. <laughs> Why is Arc Warden not in the picture? He should be in the picture. <laughs> Goodbye, Arc Warden rats. Goodbye. So, X counter relics damage type from. Ooh, from the Fuhrer! 
Oh my gosh! Ouch! That is so ouch! Okay... Oh, Bloodseeker Scepter! Okay. Oh! <laughs> Two Bloodseek! Two Raptors! Oh my goodness, that's a very big game changer! And then... Two Raptors and then you put in the blood, right? Ho ho ho, wow, that's a game changer. Battery assault, cogs, I don't really care about that. Cooldown. Uh, you know, some of these are like decreasing uh, cooldown, decrease on mana. Spirit Siphon no longer grants vision from pure to magical. Ooh, from pure to magical. What is Spirit Siphon? I'm not really... In if I don't really use the hero much, I'm not. I'm not familiar with the skills. That's that is why there's Google. Okay, okay. So this is there you go. This is old um, wiki for for um, that prophet, and there's damage that pure. It's go to magical. So that is the the like the life drain. Thank you. No longer go straight. Thank you. That is so imbalanced too. Okay. <coughs> oh my goodness. One more. <coughs> Sorry for that. Oh, that's the one that, that increased the damage, right? Causes you to jump in the air and land at the target spot, casting Ancient Totem there. Self casting the ability will make it behave the original form without jump. Are you freaking kidding me? What is this? What do you call a hero? From Roll, from Roll? Pantheon! Pantheon! He can jump, right? Globally? Right? It's, it's no longer affect the assets of Earthshaker, but the ancient totem that makes you jump 900 range, that is, that is quite long, that's quite a big range. Okay, okay, I'm looking forward to this on how, on what will be the animation on this. <laughs> will it be like the toss of Tiny? You know, that is the combo before. Tiny Toss, then Ancient Totem, SS, Fissure. But now, if you go for Scepter, you can now jump in. Oh, easy. Easy setup now. No longer need for a dagger. Ooh, okay. Okay. I don't know if this is in balance, but this is interesting. <laughs> Time Lock no longer deals double damage. Oh, come on. That makes it a quick kill for... Faithless Void. First, you made him faceless, and now no longer double damage on his stun. Scepter no longer increase. Come on! Now what does it do? What does the scepter do on Chronosphere? Macropire is no Macropire is no longer unit targetable. Targetable. Healing Ward now follows Zergonaut, Kunka, I don't really, um, Dual no longer ignores this arm and terrible states under either target. This also means that Hex units won't attack during Duel. Yeah, that happened to me! Um, I dueled the Magina and then my, my, my teammate Hexed him. And you guys know the counter attack, right? When someone is attacking, it only works if someone is attacking you. And then I noticed that I counter attacked. And I was like, why did I counter attack? He was hexed. So meaning I was he was attacking me and my mana is burning. So why why is that happening? So good thing they 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 um, fixed that. Dual scepter duration increased from six months to eight. Wow, that's very long. That's very long. I, I don't really care. I don't go dual. I don't you know, the duel of Legion Commander is freaking useless and it is very unnecessary. You want that hero to die fast with the help of your teammates. And you can't finish that one if you get stunned. Scepter to Mirana. Passively triggers a Starstorm every 8 seconds. Starstorm. Oh, that's a Starfall! Every 8 seconds. If there are no units to affect, the spell waits until there's an enemy nearby. That's not too good if the enemy does not see you. Passive procs are disabled by break. 
What? Every 8 seconds and it goes cooldown and it waits for an enemy? So when you cast a Star Storm, there's a chance another Star Storm will cast if it's on cooldown. If it's if the cooldown is over, if you have Aghanim Scepter. <laughs> oh, that adds more damage on Mirana. Replicate damage increase from 50%. Oh, wow. That's same as a hero. So, oh, same as Terror Blades. Slow. The, the, his skill of slow. Um, now affects golems. Okay. Okay. Phoenix Supernova Scepter now only increases the number of attacks needed to destroy the Supernova. 7, 10. Wow. Turnitas. <laughs> now. Okay, it's no longer you can get your teammates in the in the egg, but it increases now. It also increases now the attacks. Mm -hmm. Oh, added to captain's mode. I was really wondering why is he banned? What's what? what why? Why? Why is he auto banned? Oh, come on! Forty six max souls. Scepter now. Oh wow! Ouch! Okay, that's a good one on Silencer. Mystic Flare Scepter duration increased from 2.4 to freaking 12 seconds! Oh, oh, oh okay, so they the same damage per second. Oh, it doesn't increase anymore. Oh, so it's now 5. Thank God. Thank you, Dodo. Thank you, Volvo. Okay, I don't really, um, once again, I don't use Star Spirit much. Electric Vortex. Oh, this is the one that pulls. AOE ability. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is a, that makes him a clutch hero. And that gives him mana too and damage and armor because of the scepter. Oh, another scepter! Causes Arctic Burn to be toggle and drains 420 mana per second. Activation mana cost is as the same as 120, 110, 190. No longer has limit on number of attacks per target. Once, for the last time, I don't know what Arctic Burns mean, so Wyvern... Temporarily turns Winter and Wyvern into a flying unit. Isn't Wyvern a dragon that flies? Drains 40 mana per second. Well, th the only good thing about this is 40 mana per second. And I don't really care about this one because I don't, I don't, I don't use Wyvern. Mortal Strike now does a critical hit for double the value when attacking non-heroes. Oh, okay, so that makes his farming way faster and better. Static field, uh, no longer disables blink dagger, that's good ones. And that is the last of it. So there you have it, guys. That is the 6.7 update. Alright, so that's kind of, yeah, that is the gameplay update of 6.87. Let me just zoom that out so you can see. Yep, that is a good view. 6.87 gameplay update. So if you're going to ask me what did I like, what I like best is the Ark Freaking Warden nerf update. <laughs> but that is for you, Ark Warden. No longer divine, no longer gem for you. Whew! That is the most pissing thing that can happen in the game. Arc Warden has two divines or one divine that can really push you. Just go BKB, just go the the kinetic... No, not the kinetic field. The one that makes you miss 100% and pushes your racks. And that makes the game over. Now, no longer divine, no longer 100%. Um, no longer 100% miss if you're inside. Thank you. Thank you, Dodo. Thank you, Vav. And on the item side, what I like is the um, is the one that has the Orchid and the Crystallis. Even though that is so imbalanced, that is so imba, that gives you true strike and critical hit. 
I like it a lot. I'm looking forward to this. I'm gonna build this one with, um, yeah, clicks. Yeah, it's a good one for clicks. And what I found funny is the um, Rod of Atos. <laughs> it adds true strike. Are you freaking kidding me before? <laughs> <laughs> All I know is it gives you slow and mana and health. <laughs> Good thing they removed it because it's bullcrap. <laughs> that's yeah. That's kind of that's kind of all my comments. They're my favorites. What I my what I found interesting and funny and um, yeah, Dota you just made um, some changes that make sense. Thank you for that. So yeah, that's all my reviews about it, my comments about it, my reactions about it. So yeah, that's kind of for that's kind of for this video. So thank you guys for watching. I'm looking forward to this update. Um, I checked Steam. No more. Up, um, there's no. There's no. Um, there's no update yet. Once it w once it is released, I'm gonna try it out fast. Maybe I'm gonna show to you guys what it is. But you know, some YouTube channel has already access to it because they have they're already a big channel, and Valve have gave them their permission to um, check it out um, to make a review about it. So this is all I can offer to you guys. So yeah, that's got it. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you like this video, a comment on what you think about my, what you think about this update, about my reaction about this one. <laughs> I know, I know I have a crappy reactions about it. You can, you can, call, you can call me a noob by not knowing Rod of Arrows ha have a true strike. <laughs> I don't really care because it doesn't really make sense. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, and subscribe for more if you want to. Um, um, it's been so long since um, I I it's been so long since I've been back in YouTube. I um, kind of I'm kind of stop to it because you know finals. I'm in third year college. Finals um, came, and yeah, it's summer, so I'm gonna be back to it. So maybe you can subscribe now because yeah, I'll be back. So yeah. Yeah, so, once again, gameplay update 6 87 here we go, check it out if you like, I'm gonna leave the link in the description, or just type gameplay update 6 87 Dota 2, and there you go, there you have it, so, yeah, so thanks again guys, thanks a lot, this is JT, signing off. Ha! <sighs> Road of Arrows. <laughs>